Injured Canberra United captain Ash Sykes said it was frustrating watching a second loss in a row last weekend, but things were quickly put in perspective after a hospital visit on Tuesday. In the wake of losing to rivals Melbourne City on Sunday, the United squad converged on the Centenary Hospital to gift sick children Christmas presents through the Tom F. Carpenter's Foundation. Sykes sprained her ankle against Brisbane two weeks ago and with a three-week Christmas break looming, it's unlikely Canberra will risk the veteran against Sydney FC in round eight. Sykes returned to light training this week but must complete a fitness test on Wednesday to play in Sydney in a W League and A League doubleheader at Allianz Stadium on Friday night. Sykes said it was tough watching on against City but the 25-year-old admitted the trip to the children's hospital proved a reality check. It seems bad at the moment and it's easy to get down about not being able to play and I start getting restless when I can't exercise and can't sleep, but it really gets put in perspective visiting kids in hospital, Sykes said. What that air going there makes you realize things could be a lot worse and it was great to visit them and try to bring some Christmas cheer to the kids. Canberra boasted the best attack in the W League last season scoring 2.75 goals per game but they've struggled in six clashes this campaign and averaged just 1.6 goals per game. Sykes is the league's reigning Golden Boot winner but has netted just once in her five appearances this season and said it was frustrating but believes United are heading in the right direction. Obviously you'd like to contribute by scoring goals, that's what I am there for, but we're still going through a process and have had some really difficult games where the other team's game plan has shut us down quite effectively, Sykes said. We're building and there were still lots of positive signs in Breaking City's press. It just takes a bit of patience, we're improving every week and I am not too worried because I know it will come. United first-year coach Heather Garriok has implemented an unorthodox approach this season playing strikers in defence and despite the lack of goals, she defended her tactics. My philosophy depends on who you play against and I always look at oppositions and look where their strengths and weaknesses are. That's my philosophy as a coach, Gary Ock said. In terms of consistency, the most important thing is every player in the squad knows their job and their role. In terms of personnel for this weekend, whoever plays in whatever positions, they need to do a job and do it well. Gary Ock has not picked the same starting 11 this season and said her side only changed due to player availability, but conceded they needed to score more goals. It's a concern that we have yet created too much up front, especially with the quality we have got, but I think Ash Sykes plays a big role in that, Gary Ock said. Nikki Flannery as well, who was available on the weekend, but we do need to rectify that this week. So that's my job and if I am not getting the results I take responsibility for it.